Today dismissed all impeachment charges against Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas. This ends the House Republican push to remove the cabinet secretary from office over his handling of the U.S.-Mexico border. WG and Shannon Halligan here with details. Hi, Shannon. Yeah, Republicans had pushed for a full impeachment trial. Democrats, however, argued that the articles of impeachment were unconstitutional. The Senate never even set up the chamber for the impeachment proceedings before the articles of impeachment against Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas were dismissed. And we felt very strongly that we had to set a precedent that impeachment should never be used to settle policy disagreements. Republicans rejected a proposed agreement for Senate debate time, so Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer called for the votes to dismiss the two charges. We're supposed to have debates on the issues, not impeachments on the issues. We are not supposed to say that when you disagree with someone on policy, then that's suddenly a high crime and misdemeanor. House Republicans narrowly voted in February to impeach Mayorkas. They cited his handling of the border, stating in the two articles that he willfully and systematically refused to enforce immigration laws. There should have been a full trial. The American people should have been able to see the evidence and evaluate for themselves. This was the first time in nearly 150 years that a cabinet secretary was impeached. But Democrats argued this was all just a charade. This is all part of the Marjorie Taylor Greene show. And it's unfortunate that she's driving the agenda on so many issues as it relates to the extreme MAGA Republicans in the House. The votes for the two articles were 5148 and 5149, both along party lines. Mayorkas has said he's focused on the work of his department. Live in the newsroom, Shannon Halligan, WGN News. Thank you, Shannon.